despite the idea of having a little more snow, a lot of people are starting to think green, as in gardening. We are joined now by Elaine Pence. Elaine, you are the owner of Landscapers Corner. That is correct. And tell us, are we here with planting season? Is this the time we need to start? That? A lot of people are getting their gardens ready. A lot of people are doing grass seed, fertilize, mulching. We're selling a lot of mulch. We're selling a lot of soils. Um, a lot of compost, a lot of soil amendments to get our gardens and yards ready for spring. Now, with the chance, of course, for you know that bad S word that we're not allowed to say in the forecast, is it okay to start planting even with the threat of maybe even some more freezing temperatures over Absolutely, the next two weeks? Absolutely, yeah. There, you know, with the the way things are going and preparing our soil, yeah, this is you know this winter is on its way out, so everybody is getting excited and it's it. It's going to be fun. So one or two freezes won't hurt it. I don't think so. Do you have any recommendations for plants? Anything that would be very low maintenance for someone to start gardening with? Well, I'm not pretty very much an expert on plants. I, you know, my my field of expertise is the the soils and the mulches. So I would probably, you know, consult with somebody, you know, one of the the nurseries or something as far as as the um, plantings. Um, we uh, primary sell, you know, mulches and the soil amendments and things like that. So we get the soil ready for the plants to go in. How far in advance do you need to really start getting the soil ready before you bring in your heavy duty planting? Uh, well, you know, everybody gets in, the, in a hurry and so they want to get going when we see warm weather. So there's, I don't think there's really any rule of thumb. I think when you're ready, you're ready and we just have to be prepared for you to come get your stuff from us. And is it something you can do in a day? I mean, can you prepare your garden for spring in a day or does it really take a process of a week or two? Uh, you know, there is a process. You know, people will put things to bed in the winter time and then when it starts getting warm, they'll add some compost, you know, to their soil to get everything kind of moving and ex excited. Um, but it's just, you know, it's just really a personal, a personal preference. A lot of old people, you know, will, or older people, I should say, they have their, you know, the farmer's almanac, and, and they go by those things and the signs, and, you know, tomato plants are supposed to be planted, I think, like uh, Memorial Day, not Memorial Day, Derby Day, and yep. flowers are planted mothers by Mother's Day. So it's, it's something, you know, along those lines. But you guys could come out work on it in a day, get it ready, prepared? Well, actually, we are just a landscape supply company. So all we do is we sell all the good stuff for your gardens, like, the, like I said, the soils and the mulches and things like that. So we don't do anything like that. We just have all of the supplies, grass seeds, fertilizers, mulches, and soil amendments, and mulch. You have you. to lay the groundwork. Right. <laughs> so you and know who to go to when you need to start gardening. More news is coming up when we've returned.